Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Raptor Dad Gaming, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to download and install the presets for Reset and DCS. So, let's get it started. First, I want to show you that I do not currently have it installed. That's the name of the preset we're going to be installing, but scrolling down here, you can see it's not actually here. And basically, it's just remembering it from when I just created it. So, I'm going to get rid of it, and again, just to show you that it's not here, boom. It's going to be the RDG High Impact Good Day Desk day dusk dawn preset i think is what i called it but anyway again just showing you guys here i got a lot of presets and some of them are pretty cool so i'll be releasing them others not so much um huge shout out to cubanace and a couple other folks uh they're the ones that kind of inspired me to just release them for free on my discord and so that's what i'll be doing real quick i uh, want to look at the settings these are my settings that i currently have in game Notice the SSAA high impact of the game, absolutely huge. It will kill your frames, but it makes your images look nice and crisp. So when I'm taking photos, I wanna go ahead and kick that up to two. MSAA is off, and the reason for that is you can't actually use the cinematic DOF, which really helps with making those photos pop, drawing a little bit more emphasis on the actual aircraft or whatever you're trying to focus on. So if you look it up, I think they say SSAA is not as good, but for whatever reason in DCS, absolutely recommend going with the 1.5 or 2 whichever you can handle there the rest of this eh, that really matters so much because we're just focusing on the aircraft however gamma i know for in particular this one reset that i'll be showing you or preset that i'll be showing you looks kind of dark to me so if you find the same if you find it to be the case then you can go ahead and increase your gamma uh, mine's is at base 2.1 and that's what i recommend there so We'll go ahead and exit this and let's get into actually installing it. All right, so we're in Discord. I'm gonna go ahead and scroll down to my channel here and you see I've got DCS reshade presets. Yes, that's a cursed viper. <laughs> I do that just for the heck of being evil sometimes. But anyway, uh, you see I got a bunch of other different channels here but the main thing is this DCS reshade presets. Disregard all this other information. It's just kind of, you know, whatever womp womp. Anyway, we want to go down here to this download, click on that. It's going to say that it's unsafe. I promise you it absolutely is. So whatever browser it says, just, you know, keep, ignore, whatever you need to do. Go ahead and press forward with it. There are no viruses in this, I promise you. If there are, please let me know. Um, so far from the initial feedback, I haven't heard of any viruses, so yay! So go ahead and keep it. And uh, from there, you go to your downloads. Whoops, I didn't keep. I'm not sure why. That's weird. There we go. All right, cool. So it's there. So we're going to have two file explorers open. OK, so one is going to be our downloads here. And there it is. Sweet. Awesome. Next, we're going to actually go put this into the bin file of DCS. So go to wherever you have installed. And this will be for the open beta, mind you. So it might be a little different for the stable version. So you want to go your C drive, program files, Eagle Dynamics. And you want to look for the BIN folder. Um, if you need help with installing Reshade, I actually have a video for that as well. But once you're in here in the BIN folder, another thing I want to mention is some of them I have duplicated settings. Uh, I think the Magic HDR and a couple others. It's super easy. If you want to, you can see I've got a couple of them here duplicated. Just copy and paste that setting. So for example, for the Magic HDR, I think you saw on there I had two of them. If not, you, know, you can go back to the video and I'll show you what the actual preset is. But you basically just copy and paste whatever setting you want to have additional ones of. Sometimes it's good to stack a couple settings if you find that you like it, or sometimes you want to just create a unique effect. So just copy and paste it and you're good to go. All right, so actually dropping that in here, super easy. We'll go back to, we'll scoot this over. Go to our downloads, which is right here. We'll take that preset and just drop it in. It will ask you for permission to do so, and that's it. All right, easiness. We'll close this out and let's get DCS started. All right, so we're in the game doing a quick mission here over Nevada. So this is the one preset that I selected to previously before installing the new one. So we press the home key to open up the menu. We're gonna scroll down here and boom, there's our preset, money. All right, as I mentioned before, I felt like this was a little bit dark, but uh, press apply these to top, active to top rather. And it shows you everything that's in here. And so just a reminder, you might have to copy and paste. You see, I've got the two magic HDRs in here. Um, you can go ahead and turn it off if you want to. Again, the order actually matters. So as you reorder these settings, 
it will actually change how the game looks. So keep that in mind. You see how it looks now I turn one off. You might like that one more so. Um, another thing is if you decide to do that, you want to start making changes and edits. What I recommend doing is go ahead and just making a new preset so that way you don't ruin the original. So let's just go here for example, we'll go uh, RDG high impact uh, edit one, two, whichever here. Bloop. So that way you still have your base one that you know is pretty decent and then you can start adding stuff around. You can start messing around with it. You know, you want to do a little bit of tone mapper, see how that affects it. You want to try and brighten it up a different way. And there you go. All right. Look at that. Oh yeah. It's looking nice. Absolutely phenomenal uh, livery by Texac. Um, he's on the Grinelli um, Discord page as well as a couple other places. He's made the Mirror Raptor as well. Just phenomenal work on his end. And boom, look at that. That's what that pre We'll go ahead and screenshot that money. Screenshot that. As always, if you found this video helpful, consider liking and subscribing. It will definitely keep the content flowing. Wrap the dad out. Thanks for watching.